What up? It's your boy NWP, but you can call me Pwn, and we're back at it today with another video that I've been trying to make for a few days now. But you know how it's been. There has been an unrelenting wave of new leaks and information coming out about season 13 specifically, and we gotta get that information out to you guys as fast as we can. But this video and this topic is something that is actually right in my wheelhouse because I absolutely love what's been happening in the entertainment scene with video games outside of the games themselves. And there's nothing more awesome than stuff like the Castlevania Netflix series. I absolutely love the new Halo franchise on TV as well. And then looking at some of the other things like the Monster Hunter movie, there's been a lot of awesome stuff happening. But first guys, let's get this stuff out of the way. If you enjoy the channel, how about taking the time right now to like this video. And if you're new, smash down that subscribe button with the notification bell so that you can get alerted anytime that I drop a new video. Now, let's go all the way back to the beginning on this one because this is an interesting topic and it is a little bit nuanced to say the very least, okay? so. All the way back in August of 2020, Chad Grenier was speaking to Games Radar about different stuff happening in Apex Legends over the future. And when poked about the question of an animated series for Netflix, he said, yeah, I would love to do that. That sounds awesome. A Netflix animated series? Sign me up. I think right now we are focused on making the game, but heck, if someone wants to pitch me something, I'll listen. So right there, we had the first seeds of what could be in the future of Apex Legends. And obviously, we all ran away like wildfire with these statements saying there is or must be a new animated series in the works. Now, around a year later or so, we got a rate of, you know, during a Reddit AMA, we got it, some information from Ryan Rigney, who was again asked the same question about the series on Netflix and he answered with a zipped up emoji saying well you can't speak on it because that's what a zipped mouth means can't speak that doesn't mean won't speak that means can't not supposed to so again another influx of people getting excited hyped and just coming up with different ideas of what could be happening with this series for Netflix now, there was a lot of debate on whether or not it would be an animated series or a live action movie or franchise. And in that regard, I think we actually finally got an answer to what to expect, but also some confirmation that Apex is in fact looking to release an animated series in the future. And yes, I do say animated series because a multitude of the voice actors for Apex Legends were tweeting out that they were working at Warner Brothers Studios on the exact same day. Now, of course, we can throw out there that maybe they're doing voice acting for a different trailer or something else to do with the game, but it's highly unlikely just because we do know from different interviews and different developer sources that a lot of the voice acting has been done at home on their own personal setups and has also been done inside respawn studios it has not been done at warner brothers studios so it's safe to assume that potentially they are working on a new project that involves a good chunk of the voice actors from apex and one thing in particular that kind of gives away at least an idea of where the story could be going is the fact that our newest addition to the games newcastle had his voice actor on scene as well now this doesn't mean necessarily that we'd be at a most modern time of the game in the upcoming series or that it would be around this time even in the series because newcastle's voice actor is clearly also jackson williams bangalore's brother so he could have a major pivotal role in the Bangalore story arc and it could be a Bangalore centric series who knows what they plan to do 
I would like to see, honestly, something that explores the origin stories. Maybe that's what we're seeing. Each and every legend gets their own episode where it's a full origin story that answers a lot of the unanswered questions that we've had about the future of Apex Legends and the past of Apex Legends. Now, there is a ton of speculative information that we could go over, and honestly, it's probably worth a little bit of the idea, but what we do know for fact is that it's most likely going to be an animated series because the voice actors don't necessarily fit the physical description of the legend that they would be acting as, and they're not necessarily actors either. So it's, it's very unlikely that they were all there for a filming session and is much more likely that these guys were being on scene doing voice work for an upcoming project. And that upcoming project, just arguably by the amount of the voice actors that were there on scene, is most likely an Apex related project. So I'm, I'm hopeful that we'll be getting some information about this within a few seasons to say the least about it. I think there is clearly some teasers going out in the, the social media land and there's definitely a lot of hype around video game entertainment in general. And when you look at things like the Arcane series from League of Legends and how well it was perceived, I mean, you're really looking at a, a real way to make a good chunk of money and make the player base happy with a more descriptive story on what's been happening in the legends lives which you know a lot of people are interested in the story for every single player that doesn't care about the story there's probably at least one to two that are interested in some story or another be it their own legend or the entire story of apex overall me personally i like the entire story that's happening seeing what's been unfolding and everything in between so i'd really like to see the origin stories and maybe even finish off some of the stories that have been opened and left kind of on a page without a, that page ever being turned to the next portion for instance what is happening with crypto's sister what in the world happened with those people that were attacking rampart shop there's just so many open books that have not been finished that i would like to see something actually get at least a little bit of closure to it kind of like what we saw with loba and revenant and then horizon and ash there's a little bit of closure there so i'd really like to see some some of that stuff really get explained for the future but i'd love to hear what you guys have to say about it drop the comments down below and let me know your opinion on the animated series coming out for apex legends what would you like to see in a series and what would you not like to see what would actually be against your preference drop some comments down below and let me know what your opinion is because this one is definitely interesting and i'd love to discuss this topic a little further and if you'd like to continue this conversation maybe you'd like to start another one head on over to the social media links give them a like a favorite a follow whatever you haven't done already it will be greatly appreciated and it goes a long way to helping the channel maintain throughout the years and if you want a chance to win, you know, battle passes, Apex coins, and everything in between, best place to find out is on social media, where I like to uh, do nonsense like that for the community and hook them up so that it makes life just a little bit easier in the long run. But clearly, there is something afoot, and the voice actors have been teasing a little bit of action. And with this happening right now around the launch of a new season, it does seem that they would be definitely working on something outside the actual Apex Legends game voice acting that we've come to ever so love. But clearly, there is a, going to be a long time before the release of an animated series. It's not something that we could say is necessarily in the bag, but I would argue that it probably did start right around the time that Ryan Rigney was given the zipper face emoji, the voice acting coming a little bit after the rough animation had started, etc. So there's probably some finalization, editing, and production stuff to do before it comes out. 
However, here's another video you can check out if you feel so inclined. Thanks for watching. Thanks for liking. Thanks for subscribing. And don't forget, you won't be able to see a live action series or an animated series if you don't stay safe, stay healthy, and as always, have a good one.